Have you ever wanted to embed a code snippet in your blog, website or simply host and share it with just anyone on the website? Even if you don't have any website on your own, it's quite simple. Here's how to do that. We are going to use GitHub for doing this. So if you don't have an account already in GitHub, go ahead and create one. It's free. The pricing says that there is a free account that uh, provides us public and private repositories, unlimited public and private repositories. So you can go ahead and use that, which means that you can either have code snippets shared with your friends and colleagues uh, using the public repositories or just have your own code hosted and then saved for future use under private repositories. If you don't have an account, go ahead and create it. And I already have an account, so let me sign in. After signing in, all we have to do is create on this plus and then create a new gist. A gist is nothing but a simple code snippet that we want to give a name and then they just paste in paste the code inside it and save it. So for a sample code here, I'm going to use a code that I have uh, that I use for in Google Docs give a file name to that. Now here's where I can either create a private repository or a public a private gist or a public gist. For now I'm going to create a secret gist. If you hover your mouse on this eye icon here it says secret gists are hidden from search engines but visible to anyone you give the URL when we share it. So you create a secret gist by clicking on this golden button. And once this is done, this is ready. This is the uh, displayed format. And if you want to just view the code, click on raw. It gives us the raw format. With this, we can either embed the code somewhere or share it with somebody using a link. So for now, if you want to embed, this is the code snippet that you want to put into, uh, let's say a WordPress uh, a uh, blog post or page so here's a sample code snippet that i have embedded and this is how the code looks let me show you how the code looks by copying it and then opening it in a notepad so here's just a one line code that is saved as a js file javascript file once we embed and publish the post in a wordpress or blogger blog this is how it looks as the complete code so once this is done, if you want to share this with somebody, you, all you need is to click on this drop down and select share. And that gives you a URL that could just be copied and pasted to anybody. This is the public URL. I'm sorry, this is the private uh, secret gist. So if you want to make it public, you could edit it. This is secret here. So you want to just make it public. And uh, next, when you share it, this URL is now shareable with the world. That's it uh, about using GitHub Gist. This is totally free and you can make use of this code hosting for free without using any plugins in case you're using a WordPress self-hosted website. So all you need to do is to take this embeddable uh, code snippet and then insert into your WordPress blog post or or just to use this to share with anybody to collaborate. I hope you like this video. If so, please hit on the like button and I'll see you again in my next video. Until then, bye.